Hey guys, it's Rindy and I am here today with a very exciting September update for my A to Z project pan. So let me get right into this. I'm going to start in this little thing that has some empties in it. Three empties to be exact. So the first one for D was my Burt's Bees Day Lotion and this one is gone. I can't pump any more out. I can't pour any more out. So that one is done for S, my protein nail supplement. This one I have been saying is going to be done for months now. It's finally actually done. So no more protein nail supplement and I'll move on to a different nail oil and it's exciting exciting but maybe the most exciting 4-0 is my CoverGirl Outlast Stay Luminous Foundation this one is finally gone I even took the lid off and tipped it upside down so it would collect in the cap so I could use it that's why the cap is dirty so it is gone so this one has been around for more than a year with me trying to use it and Holy cow, guys, I need to use foundation better or something. So that's all my empties. Let me go by the alphabet now. The next letter I had still in the project was the letter G. That is my precious gold eyeliner. It has gone from the blue down to the purple here. Let's see. And so not much progress, but I've just been using it in my waterline, and I haven't needed to sharpen it because I've been working on the vintage liner that you will see in a minute. So for H, I have the IBY Highlight Palette. This one was down to the two and it's looking like this. There's still quite a bit. I use this one to contour my cheekbones and this one I've been using under my neck to kind of contour away my double chin. But there is quite a bit of both of those left, so we'll see if those can be done by the end of the year even. So for I, I have my DLS Shadow Crayon in Illusion, and it has gone, it was at the blue, and now it is doing the curvy line that I drew the purple for. Because I've been using it, and it's been moving, but it, it, it doesn't, could I stutter more? It doesn't... Uh, show it unless I draw this curve. So that is what it's doing right now if it would stop focusing on everything else. So if you can see, I drew the curve and hopefully it'll move from there and show progress better. So the next thing was my NYX Jet Set liner and that one has gone nowhere. My Mary Kay Shadow Quad is down to looking like this. The fourth color is in a different project. So these two are completely empty. And I have that much pan on the final gold shadow. So hopefully I can make some progress on that and maybe get it out by next month. And that will be one more product that I am through for this project. My LA Colors in Lilac Illusion... I did the same thing. I was trying to figure out why it looks so good. It was way up at the blue, and then it's kind of doing a curve thing instead of a straight line. So I drew the curve, and this part of it is actually still on the blue line, but it's got a dent in the other side of it because I use it more as a highlight than anything. So... That's why that one is what it is. So my Too Faced Melted Chihuahua. This one, it just keeps holding on. It's getting harder and harder to squeeze out. I've been using it as a cream blush and liking it that way. I am thinking that within the next month, I will be pulling out the little, this, this little like sponge applicator thingy and seeing if I can't squeeze the rest of it into a pot. But I'm also not sure if I care enough to do that or if once I can't squeeze any more out, I am done. But this one's holding on quite a bit longer than I'd hoped. But hopefully by the end of the year, at least, it will be done. Oh, my goodness. So my CQ, for the letter Q, my CQ lipstick in the shade sunset this one i use for correcting my dark circles under my eyes so i went from the blue down to the purple and i just like literally get a little on my finger and pat it under my eyes so that one isn't moving as fast as say if it was like an actual being used on my lips but it's moving and you know project panning isn't about 
using it excessively or more than you need to. It's just about using it consistently to get through them and enjoy your products and use your products. So I don't want to get excessive on it. I just want to get use on it. So that's that's what that is. So then my vintage eyeliner, this one is looking like this. And it has made some good progress. Like I said, I didn't do much of the gold because the vintage last couple months had the black progress and the blue progress. And now it's the purple progress. So I have used it quite a bit more than I had, especially in the previous month. So I am focusing on that. I've been enjoying the black eyeliner more than the gold right now just because I'm doing some more poppy fall looks. And I like how it makes the, the colors stand out when I put black in my waterline and stuff. So it is, it is what it is. I'm getting through it. Then the final thing that is left in this product, product, project, is the Temptu Times Boxy Charm, or the X Boxy Charm for the letter X. And I am at the orange line or the red line. And it's actually like a thick line. It was barely underneath that purple line because I had been using this and getting all this progress because I've been using it as an actual base and that started breaking me out. So I stopped doing that. I've started just tapping it where I would put highlight before I use powder. So that one I'm expecting to slow down, maybe not be done in that, at least not using it in that capacity anytime soon but I am debating on taking it and putting it into a lotion and using the lotion as like an illuminating lotion and getting it used up that way because it's not being useful in its current form for me because half the time I forget before I powder to put on the highlighter or I have a powdered foundation in a project right now with the other one used up so I've been forgetting. But anyhow, that is my update. I'm down to 10 products, I believe, left out of the 26 we started with. So I say that's pretty good, and I believe I can get through at least a couple of these before the end of the year. But I hope you stick around and check out my progress. Keep, keep an eye on my progress. Check out the other fantastic ladies in this collab. And until next time, I will talk to you all later.